New Orleans City Council is calling on the state legislature to reimburse 425 families, almost $7 million. Today's council action is the result of our David Hammer investigation with our partners at the Times-Picayune, Verite, and ProPublica. And David's joining us now in the studio with more on this important move. David? Yeah, Katie and Sharice, our investigation got the state to forgive homeowners who used road home elevation grants on repairs instead of using it for elevating their houses. But we also showed how the state didn't do anything for people who already paid the money back. And the city council says today that's not fair. In February, the state forgave thousands of homeowners it sued, trying to take back $100 million in road home grants. The state said it never wanted to sue folks who had used the money to repair their homes instead of elevating them higher off the ground. It's been a miserable thing for the state of Louisiana to pursue uh, these individuals uh, because we knew the vast majority of them were never going to pay. They, they can't. They don't have it. But 425 families who already paid the state back $6.8 million were not forgiven. Homeowners like Lisa Ruiz. I paid it back and now their debt is forgiven and mine is not because I did the right thing. Today, the New Orleans City Council said that wasn't fair and called on the state legislature to reimburse those 425 families. I think it's beyond reprehensible that the legislature hasn't already done something because this legislature is currently sitting on a historic surplus. The amount of money to reimburse these homeowners is a drop in the bucket. Councilman Eugene Green said seeing our story last week was the motivation for him to sponsor the resolution. There are people who pay back into a system at great peril to their own personal finances and they needed to be treated fairly and haven't been treated fairly yet. Yeah, Councilman Green said he's sending the resolution to the New Orleans legislative delegation today. He says he's confident that one of the lawmakers will offer legislation to pay back the 425 families who are mostly in the New Orleans area. The key will be convincing the rest of the legislatures to, to agree. Katie? All right, we know you're going to continue to follow it for us. Thank you, David.